the hay, pro dumps to dive, we're back at it again. Oh, got a lot of good stuff today. All right, so I went back right now, and I got to make a decision as to what I'm going to do about this Xbox stuff, okay? So for those of you who followed the last two videos there, we found an old factory that basically repaired Xbox controllers. This is the vibration one. This is the circuit here. So we have a gold circuit here. We can take that off. We got a chip there. And in the back of it, we got a little frequency crystal there. Okay. And there's thousands of these. Okay. So frequency crystal and then some more gold there. Okay. Now all the controllers are not all the same. Some of them are a bit different. As you can basically see, uh, I guess these two, I guess these two over there are the same. But then there are some that are like a bit different. Like you see how the crystal is on this side? And then... There's four buttons on the other one. All right, the crystal's on the same side with the buttons on it. So I don't know if this is a PlayStation one or an Xbox one. It's very difficult to figure out, but I have a feeling one might be an off brand of controller. Okay, so I gotta figure that out. But I don't wanna throw this stuff out, to be honest. If you guys need it, please let me know. I do not wanna throw this good stuff out right now. Okay, so let's go over what we got. These are the buttons for the controller right now. These could be the start buttons, anything like that. These are huge buttons right now, okay? It's a, there's a couple thousand in here, maybe. I don't know, maybe, I know there's more than 100, but this basically comes in a pack, and these are the green ones here. So, I know I can tell this was loaded onto a machine and then it was input in. But if I can't fix these, I'll have to scrap them out. So I definitely have to figure out what to do about that and throw them out. These are, you guys already know, these are the, the other buttons here. Uh, and this, I guess, connects. And then those two pieces push. And I found one here. It says Matrix LTS uh, Crep. Okay, so frequency crystal there. I did find one, okay, inside of a controller already. So it seems as though they were trying to put these back together. These may have been uh, Xbox controllers that were sent back that couldn't get fixed. I don't know. I might try to fix one or two, but if I can't, I'll scrap them out. That's basically all it is right now. I can tell I'm gonna have a lot of frequency. I'm gonna have, okay, when I'm done, I'm gonna have a lot of crystals. I'll probably have a lot of chips. I'll have a lot of these nubbin pieces here, okay? But then I can't, yeah, this one is, okay, so this one does appear to be broken. You see how the the joystick is, is a bit messed up there? Yeah, it's a bit messed up. So these may have been pieces they were trying to refurbish right now. But here's the thing. These motors that are attached to them, these vibration motors, are still good, okay? Those are still good, and those are still worth money. Not a dollar a piece, but maybe two for a buck. So I may keep them and put them in a jar there. The housings for all those Xbox pieces are worth some, as well as those little controllers there. I can make my own top server with those, and I might just keep one for added issue there, okay? And then there are these ones here, which are a bit heavier right now, okay? Uh, let's also check here. Look at this. This is a huge one, all right? Let me put this up. This looks to be for PlayStation. I don't know if it's for Xbox, but it looks to be PlayStation. There's a whole bunch of different ones in here, different buttons for different things here. Th this, it does look to be PlayStation, all right? But all I'm seeing is Xbox pieces. So, all right, let, let, let's look. Okay, this, I think this is Xbox, okay? Xbox, Xbox, it's all Xbox. But that looks, it does look to be PlayStation. I don't know. All right, so I got to figure this out right now. Uh, also, I got these pieces here, so these are also good. All right, so we're going to have to figure out. That might be a little bit of a slug. Yeah, that's a slug there, so. All right, guys. Uh, Pro Dumpster Diver out. This is interesting. Also, I still have these back covers. I might sell 10 for a dollar online if you guys want to go ahead and check it out. So what I'll do is this. I'll take pictures of this and put it up if you guys need it. We got these as well. As I said, you never know. You never know who needs it. 
All right, as I said, there's other ways to make money or you can scrap it out. So I got a lot of gold here and crystals here. So I'm gonna see what I can do with the time I have right now. It's 925. What I might do is just scrap these out today, put the rest of junk, and I'm gonna put everything in different bags and then basically just see how that is. All right, and I'll sell some of the stuff online, see if people wanna buy it. All right, Pro Dumpster Diver out.